school left at her brother's prom dress, but starts crying when they find out why. Prom short for promenade is a formal dance held for high schoolers. Near the end of the school year, whether it was a magical experience or a horrific one if you went to high school prom, I am sure that it was a night to remember for so many teenagers. The prom is the highlight of their entire high school lives. It is the one school event many students look forward to in their high school years. Many see it as a rite of passage into adulthood. But proms can also be a disaster. There are usually high expectations for girls to impress their dates by outdoing their friends and a sense of being elegant. Girls prepare themselves for prom days, maybe even weeks in advance. They go to tanning beds, look for the perfect dress, search for the most suitable accessories, and they even get their nails and hair done to perfection. But then for Antoinette, it was the other way around. She doesn't do it to impress her. Eight but more to impress her brother Antoinette from Indianapolis, and is a teenager who was about to celebrate her prom at Ben Davis High School. Ever since they were kids, Antoinette and her brother Antonio used to dream of being in a prom night together. Just like most teens, it is a once-in-a-lifetime event that we all look forward to. Both of them knew exactly who Antonio wanted to take with him, his beloved sister, Antoinette. Sadly, due to an unfortunate event, he never got the chance to experience prom night. It was way back in 2017 when Antonio's life was cut short. Due to his friend playing with a gun, it was an incident that took his life. Micah Sanders was the suspect who shot Antonio in the head while playing with his revolver. After the tragic incident, he was sentenced to two years in jail. In July of 2017, after admitting reckless homicide as well as dangerous possession of a firearm, Sanders insisted his friend's death was a tragic accident, but Antoinette accused him of deliberately killing Antonio. According to Antoinette, this wasn't an accident. You don't accidentally shoot someone in the forehead. Her mom even added. I don't feel it. Was an accident because of what I have heard, but then after a couple of speculations, Sanders has now been released from prison and is currently the subject of an arrest warrant over claims that he has violated the terms of his community correction sentence. Until now, they are still grieving over what happened to Antonio. Antoinette felt sad, knowing that she gets to see the person that killed her brother on social media, just able to say this is what he ate today and this is what's happening in his life as if he didn't do anything wrong. She just can't accept it. Antonio and Antoinette were siblings, but they were also the best of friends and each other's. All their life, they shared almost everything, birthday parties, scoldings and of course they fought together too. So his dream of going to the prom with his sister and their friends and to graduate together are made to life by his sister. Though his life ended so soon, she didn't want her brother's dream to end. So she made something memorable and worthwhile. She wanted to pay tribute to her brother. So when the time came for internet to get ready for prom, she got in touch with Mariah Jackson, a local fashion designer who had also lost someone close to her through gun violence. She incorporated everything in Antoinette memories and imagination and created something Antoinette can envision. Antoinette wanted to wear a dress with all the pictures of her brother in it. She didn't just pick any picture with his face. She made sure all the pictures on that dress have a story. Antoinette told a news outlet about the unique frock. I feel amazing. I feel like I'm not going for just one. I should have bought two tickets. The clothing shows the deceased teen smiling and reveals his love of playing football. The piece covers Antoinette's arms with a sheer fabric and purple embellishments and features Swarovski crystals. She made sure that her dress is in memory of her brother and that even though he's not present at the prom anymore, his memories are with her all through the night. With Mario's help, Antoinette created something so meaningful and tangible out of the precious memories of her brother. This way Antonio could still be with her on that special night, as it turned out, her family said the prom dress was more beautiful than they could have ever imagined. Simple but full of meaning and love. What Antoinette showed to all the people at the prom is a dress full of love and respect to her brother, Antonio. It takes time for someone who has lost a loved one to recover. Move on in our hearts. Their memories will always be there, and while they may already be away from us, they are surely never gone. Thank you so much for watching until the end. Be sure to tap the next videos for more inspiring and loving stories here on Extreme Trends.